Hi, it's Paddy and welcome to day 301 of the Daily Do. Stress is like an orange, slowly getting squeezed. You don't know when or where it'll burst, juice squirting dangerously. Then we think the problem is the juice and where it went. The angry outburst, the silent storm, the spiteful text we sent. We seek help for how to treat the spills instead of how to stop the squeeze. The stress before the outburst, the pressure, not the release. Stress is like an orange slowly getting squeezed. You don't know when it's going to pop, juice squirting dangerously. In the snap and bristle, bark and bite of our speech on a short fuse, our thinking crumbles under stress and ultimately we lose. We lose the present moment trying to catch the one just gone. The pressure mounts and then we crack and the damage then is done. And where this damage reaps its worst is unthinkingly just where you're at. The juice in the eye of whoever's close, the last straw on the camel's back. But the straw was not the problem, the anger just the sign that all is not so well for you. The problem is inside. Don't start mopping up the flooded floor until the tap's turned off. Go to the centre of your stress before you fix the stuff that you have done when bubbling over. You can fix that with stress managed. Or more and more stress builds and builds as you're trying to stem the damage. This pressure cooker needs release and often or it explodes, shooting hot words randomly, damage everywhere it goes. But relieve the pressure and all is well. It ticks over quite the thing, efficient and consistent, perfectly and calmly cooking. Relieve the tension, pressure and stress that builds in you today before you snap, pop, burst and bubble at whoever's in your way. Five minutes sitting breathing is your steam gauge calming down. Release the pressure of the squeeze before the damage done. If you enjoy The Daily Do, please share it with your friends. Tell them they can get it on Apple Podcasts, iTunes, Spotify, CastBox and Podbean. Or you can subscribe for a free morning email at www.thedailydo.co or email me anytime, paddy at thedailydo.co. I'd love to hear from you. Or say hi on Instagram, Facebook and Twitter at The Daily Do. Bye for now and see you tomorrow on The Daily Do.